hither. Come hither. What's up? I ain't been hithered in a minute. Oh. <laughs> you know? Like hithering me. <laughs> no hithering you? Better the people. <laughs> How you doing, Lori? I can't complain. Patty? Living dreams. Still looking for your phone? I actually, my phone is, is destroyed. What? Yeah, yeah, my girl knocked it out of my hand, this, and it just smacked on the ground. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I did lose my phone for a minute, but it was just in my trailer. Uh, okay, well, you found it. That's good. <laughs> Speaking of your girl, yeah. congratulations on the new love. I got a new boot, too. You got a new boot. Thank you. Girl. <laughs> you got a whole baby. What? I didn't even know. Like, I'm sorry. Your daddy. Oh, yeah. Zaddy. Roman John. Yes. How does it feel? Never happened to us. I know. Well, yeah. I love it. I love it. How does it feel to be an uncle and a, and a dad? It's so weird. Is it? It's yeah. well, I don't know because I don't know because we just. It's weird that he has a kid. Yeah, man. But it's dope. Is 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 weird in a dope way. I remember when we found out that uh, we were working, and it was like, oh, the baby's coming, and naturally we we couldn't do nothing until we got off work. But do you know video of him having just been told that the baby was born because he had to work and his that was it that was the that was the face that was a pretty intense was like, okay that was pretty intense yeah we went up right right after work we went up and he, met him one of my other homies mike we drove to rockford right after we were done shooting oh i used to work at the tv station in rockford i heard about you up there they said that they miss you <laughs> no for real no, it's no, legit. No, I know. No, you should think about it. <laughs> what do I need to think about? Oh, they miss you up there. No, they do. But no, but it was, but it's, it, it's amazing, and you know what it does, though. But having a son, I think, has, um, it's, it's really made my approach to Atwater a lot more powerful. It's like now I truly understand my assignment on this show. You know, my son um, and his joy is probably the most important thing to me, and so now as an artist, the preservation of black boy joy. Um, indirectly, the protection of black women yeah. is extremely important to me now. That's the way I approach my character. That's the way, you know, I create outside of this character. And so now having my son, I think, has really just made me a stronger artist to be able to tell these stories more authentically. And it gives us all something to connect to, right? So yeah. if I'm more intense, Patty gets more intense, and then Rosewater is... It's, about to mess them up. No, I know. So one of the things that you mentioned is about other art outside of the character that you do personally. Mm -hmm. The thing I notice is poetry. Mm -hmm. And I know. he's incredible. So I wrote a little poem because I wanted to get your opinion since you're an expert in this. For, it was just a personal poem. Okay. It's not like about you. I, I, why would it be? <laughs> so, it so it's not, it's not about you. You, but here's my poem. Let me hear that. Time stands still when he's around. A love so profound, deep and true. The passion. Ooh. Is this real life or a fairy tale? I can't tell. But for now, I'm giving it all to you. Girl, girl, girl. Not too shabby. Is that for your new boo? Hey, let's just keep it a secret. We don't have to tell anybody, but... I, th I thought it was great. Yeah. It, but I, I think the way you rhyme true and ooh, ooh. That's, 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 that's next level poetry. Okay. That's, you should keep that. Well done. I'm legit. All right. Thank you guys so much for talking to me. It's always fun. Always I thought you were going to be with Nicki Minaj, but that's another day. <laughs>